Hello, 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 and welcome to another Rang Rouge unit of the Reek. And today we are taking a look at the Ferret Entact for Australia. The Ferret can trace its roots all the way back to the Second World War, because during that war, the main British reconnaissance vehicle was the Damler Dingo armoured reconnaissance vehicle, to be a bit more precise, and it saw a pretty good track service through the entirety of the war used on pretty much every single front. And after the war, the British Armed Forces went back to down there and said, hey, could you make us a more modern version of this car? And so they did. In the 50s, they came up with the Ferret. And the Ferret said a lot of the same parts with the original Damler, they did change a few things around, such as the engine and armaments and whatnot. And speaking of the armaments, this thing has a lot of different versions in terms of weapon configuration. You got some with an open top with just a machine gun on a mantle. You got a turret version with a brown machine gun. You got versions with missiles on the sides. You got versions with stream fire missiles, which looks like a bloody pizza box, I have to say. And a bunch of small different configurations throughout the years. It's a very modular vehicle that could change out parts rather easily because it was pretty small and it wasn't really too much to do. And it's short service through the entirety of the Cold War for the British Armed Forces and pretty much all of their branches and it's kind of been slowly phased out. It's a bit obsolete these days. In battle, the Ferret Entac is a 15-point vehicle with two weapons available to it. And the first weapon being the M1919 machine gun, and it's a rather crappy machine gun, I have to say. It's only really good for defending yourself against small infantry squads. Don't be expecting this to do a lot of damage. And secondly, we got the Entac missile, that aptly named for the Ferret, with a range of ground of 2.1 kilometers, 35% accuracy, 20 AP, a reload time of 20 seconds, and six missiles available to the vehicle. And it's, um, it's short range, and it's inaccurate, but it has rather good AP power at 20, so this can do a bit of damage if you can hit something. And if you pop down to the Miscellaneous Stats, run armor all around, 10 HP, medium size, poor optics, 95 kilometers off road, 150 on the road, a whopping 710 kilometers autonomy, year restricted to 1960, and type restricted to support, motorized, mechanized, and airborne decks. In battle, the Ferret Antac is rare. Have any of us really used this unit? I certainly haven't. Even an Antac deck, so I've never really bothered to bring out the Antac. But it's, it's not entirely crap. Yes, it is still a pretty crap unit, but it has two things going for it. The first one being it's incredibly bloody fast. 95 kilometers off the road will allow you to zoom across open plains. Easy peasy and get to the front line fast. And also the missile. It has rush range and a high-end tank cannon. Good luck hitting the broadside of a barn, but Trini AP power is pretty damn good. That will allow you to deal damage to medium tanks, and you can one-shot kill IFVs and you know low armor APCs as well. And for 15 points, that's that's pretty good. You got speed and you got power. You just kind of miss in infantry power, accuracy, and range. But you're paying 15 points, you can't exactly have anything, everything. And they're fun, they're, they're not great, they're not meta, you shouldn't make a strategy around them, but if you get a few of them, attack them across the open, kill an APC or two, do a damage to a few tanks, you can actually find kind of a use for these guys, and they're not that bad. Just make sure to get a lot, because you're going to need a lot to actually effectively hit an enemy vehicle but yeah they're, they're not great they're not amazing this is a pretty anzaki unit i have to say but hey, hey they're, they're kind of fun to use in their sadistic ray and i'm gonna leave it off yeah this has been another rang rouge unit of the reek i hope you guys enjoyed the video and as usual please just take it easy ruff, ruff.